Hey guys, welcome back to Smart Trader. This is Dias Paul, and thank you so much for your likes, comment, share, and subscribe to my channel. And if you're a new viewer, then definitely go to my channel and watch all these videos. And only if you're liking these videos, then you can go hit the subscribe button to be a part of Smart Trader family. And for the ones who want additional services, you can WhatsApp the team seven eight nine two six five two four eight one to know what are the additional services. So without wasting time, let's start off with today's topic. So it's been a, almost a week if you see it's been almost a week of putting videos and most of you guys are waiting for the video so definitely i thought i'll make a video a trick video how to pick an intraday stock on every hourly basis so definitely you guys would be happy and that will definitely offset the one weeks uh, we have not posted any videos in one week so that will definitely offset and i'm sure that you guys would be happy with this so therefore let's start off with our how to pick stock on an hourly basis so before i start off this uh strategy i would say this strategy is just for educational purpose only this is just a research done from my experience what i learned from others what i have seen in the market so this is for educational purpose only please decide from your own side okay so if you're investing in anything or it's always your decision it's not my decision so by saying that what you need to do is first of all when the market is open for the day when you want to trade so if you don't have time to trade during the nine o'clock or some people have time during 10 o'clock or some people have time to trade during 11 o'clock or 12 o'clock one o'clock two o'clock no problem so let's see how we can trade during every hour whenever you're free whenever during your break okay during a lunch time also so first of all, before we start off with strategy, our main role is market criteria. If Nifty is above 0.3%, we go towards buy side. If the Nifty is below 0.3% red color, then we are going to sell side. Okay, this is one criteria. This strategy works 65 to 75% of the time. So what I have seen and what I've experienced from long time, it works at 65 to 75% of the time. And when the market is above 0.3% or below 0.3%. So keeping the condition market is green and market is red first i will go to i will type in google early okay i will type in google early gainers okay so you'll get early h o u r l y early gainers so on mobile when you type this you need to click the desktop version okay not in mobile view you need to see in desktop view okay so once you come to early gainers in google you need to go to economic times so once you click on this economic times you get the early gainers over here so for example if market was red for the day then i will go same thing early losers so vice versa okay i'll go to early losers so this is gainers this is losers okay red green so now i will teach you early gainer side same thing you need to apply for early losers the opposite vice versa so now let's consider the market was green for the day and we are going to trade towards buy side so i came to early gainers so one thing is if you are trading with your full money without using any margin then you can go with these stocks you can go to this filter over here i click filters over here and over here i will click on large cap stocks mainly i will trade on these large cap stocks if i'm trading on my full money but most of you guys will be doing intraday with margin right so 10 times of margin right multiples so what i what you need to do is just unselect all this go to index in index go to where is nifty yes nifty 50 okay we're going to trade only on this nifty 50 stocks so i have put a filter in this early gainers nifty 50 so you will get these stocks filtered out okay now first thing what you need to do is around 9 30 or 9 45 it's up to you open your system keep everything ready around 9 50 what you can do is for example let's consider the time frame of 9 to 10 okay in live market the value gets calculated like 9 50 9 55 9 56 9 57 every 40 seconds it will get refreshed so don't worry every minute will be calculated over here and the, start, the value will be changing so around 950 what you can do either of the stock will come in the top right so when the stock comes up 
open the stock, open a calculator, calculate whatever 10 times, 20 times, how much, how much is the capital, how much stocks I can buy. Keep, keep the order window ready, everything ready, okay? Sharp at 10 o'clock, the price will stand at 427.20, that is when you give a market buy, okay? So 427.20, you give a market buy, it'll purchase around 427.10 or 427.30 also. So the small margin is fine. If it's a very big capital, then you, you, can, you can put uh, bracket orders and you can place it. So when you buy at this price, you need to buy at 10 o'clock, okay? So if you see the price, last trader price was 433.45. So 427 to 433 is your profit. And this is not just the 433, guys. This is last trader price. When the day closed, this was the price. Even the stock will have a high for the day. For example, 440 was a high example. So you, your profit is 427 to 440 rupees. But what I would suggest you guys is always keep a target of 0 0.3, 0 0.6 or 1%. But keep up target, okay? Don't miss the target. So what happens is this stock is 427. You guys will keep this, buy the stock in cover order. You don't keep any target. Stock will go to 433, 440. Some market news will come around 11 o'clock, 12 o'clock. The stock will come back to 427. It will go down also. So you will lose all your money or you may not get a profit what you saw. So always I suggest is discipline is required in intraday trading and there should not be any greed. These are the weaknesses of people. So avoid these. If you're a part of smart trader family, avoid these and keep a target. As I always tell you, keep a target of whatever percent, 0 0.3, 0 0.6, 1%. I won't suggest that. It's up to you. But always keep a risk and reward ratio of 1 is to 1. That means you need to keep a target of 3 rupees. Then you need to keep a stop loss of 3 rupees. Stop loss is a must, guys. You should ensure you don't have that greed of making more money. And even the same way, you should not lose more of your money. So if 3 rupees is your profit, 3 rupees is your loss. If you lose today 3 rupees, tomorrow you can cover your 3 rupees in the next trade. Every day won't be a bad day, right? But one big day will lose all your money. So always keep your stop loss. So this was an example for people who are trading between 9 to 10 o'clock. 10 o'clock trade, 427, sold at 433, profit, close for the day, done for the day. People who are trading between 10 to 11. So this was a stock during 10 to 11, Bajaj Finance. If you see the stock around 11 was 1. 672 as i told you 1050 i'll calculate everything and keep or in 11 i will buy the stock stock has went to 1701 profit done now let's go to 11 to 12 during 12 o'clock again same technique 325 i bought this at 325.80 the stock went to 328.95 again three rupees profit again 12 o'clock i'll go <clears throat> this is one o'clock 12 to 1 so one o'clock again 381.10 385.95 again profit Again, 2 o'clock, Aaron bought it at 346, yes bank, sold it at 349. Around 3 o'clock, 1292, 1301, again profit. So I would not suggest you guys go and trade every hour, go buy, 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 buy. It doesn't work all the time, okay? Market should be very in an uptrend position, that is why everywhere you got a good profit. What I would suggest if you're trading only one particular one hour, then trade during that hour, 9 to 10, people who want to trade at 9 to 10, trade at 9 to 10 only, make one profit, close for the day, don't wait for 11 o'clock, 12 o'clock, 1 o'clock, 2 o'clock, 3 o'clock. So do not keep, do not be greedy. So whichever, for example, your lunch break is during 12 o'clock to 1 o'clock, then you can do this technique or during whatever time you require. This is just for educational purpose only. So by, by saying that, be very careful, guys. Uh, market is very fluctuating. So as I told you, keep that 0.3% in mind. The, the market should be about 0.3% to give good benefit. And this strategy works 65 to 75% of the time. This is a very old strategy. Most of the traders will be using it. And I'm also using this strategy for a longer time back in the times also and i've seen the 65 to 75% of the time this strategy works when the market is below 0.3% either the market gets flat you don't get any profit or sometimes you end up in loss also i've seen that also so what i would suggest is wait for the condition 0.3% above then try to use the strategy at that particular time don't wait don't for example 3 o'clock don't go and buy at 3:15 3 o'clock means 3 o'clock that's it so you need to have proper discipline proper idea for intraday you need to be quick to place your orders calculate everything well in advance so hope this video uh, was an add-on to your knowledge and hope you guys like this video if you like this video then go hit that like button and if you if you like if you want more of such videos then hit that like button so that i will get to know i should make more of such videos and also share this video with all your friends so that you can make this video viral and most of them can get benefited out of this thank you so much for your love see you soon in my next video bye bye